Hey Aaron, my name is Kevin. I'm from Fort Lauderdale, Florida. And I kind of need your help on front side 180s. Um, I, can, I can ollie pretty good so far. And I've been skating for about six months, not even a year. I don't know, but yeah, I kind of need your help on front side 180s. Um, I appreciate your help and thanks for your support. Awesome, so thanks a lot for sending your video. I really do appreciate it and I'm going to do my very best to help you out. That first ollie was amazing. I really did not expect you to ollie waist high. Cool, so you shouldn't have any problems with your front side 180s because you can ollie so high. Good, so let's see where you're at here. In the front side 180s, I always like to look at the head and shoulders, and what I'm looking for is to see if you're turning them. Um, interestingly enough, I've had this problem a few times you're turning your arms and you're trying to turn your shoulders but your head is staying still and that is preventing you from actually doing a full turn you have to look in the direction you're going it's so key so important and uh, here's my uh, foot positioning on the board that's my foot positioning for the front side 180 it's like a ba basic ollie position and I uh, hope you can help me Aaron I really appreciate your help and thanks for your support. Awesome, so let's see this in slow-mo. Watch your head. On that one it turns. It actually turns pretty well and on that one you almost did the full 180. So that one was definitely better. But I think when you're actually like thinking about what to do with your head it's going to be a lot easier. Watch this one. This one is where your head stands still and you can tell like right there your lower half of your body is trying to turn, but your upper half is not able to because your head is fixed. You're like looking at the same spot that you're looking at when you start to where you should be like fully turning your head to go around. So maybe you should imagine that you're going to do like a 360 or something or just practice standing on the ground and jumping and doing 360s. But what I want you to practice is turning your head and shoulders, and then turning your legs afterwards. Like if you're jumping on a trampoline, what you want to do is throw your arms and shoulders around and your head, and you have to fully turn your head, like really torque it, and then your, your legs are going to go afterwards. That is the best way, especially on something like a 360, because your head is all the way around, then you're looking where you're going, and then you can just bring your feet around. Um, I know that really well because I s was a snowboarder, so doing 360s, 540s, 720s, you got to have your head flipping around and then you're ready, then you just bring your legs down. It's actually so easy, um, definitely easier on a snowboard. But yeah, so that's the basic thing that I want to go over with you is turn your head. And then from there, all it is is you're, you're popping a 180 up in the air and then turning your, your head and shoulders, and then your legs are going to follow. I know that kind of sounds too simple, but I think we got down to the basic like reason why is just that one thing about you not turning your head. So just make sure you get that really down. Um, your ollie was really good. You don't really need to go back to that. The other thing that I would, would recommend is just start getting these down moving. Like... Get your ollies down moving and then do the 180 with a little bit of speed. I actually think it's easier to learn how to 180 with just a little bit of speed. Not only because when you land you're going to roll fakey, but just because it seems to help the momentum a little bit. So yeah, check that out. I think it's going to really get it down for ya. Cool, so get Skateboarding Made Simple. It will take you through all of these basic tricks. And then there's volume two, which does manuals, three, which does ledges, and four, which does skate parks, and then five coming soon. Shh, five's a secret. So yeah, get the video. It will help you. It's available as a digital download and an iBook. Check it out now.